everyone and welcome to NameHero.com. In this video tutorial I want to talk about a dedicated IP address and what exactly it is and why do you need one. Um, so we get this question a lot and if you notice um, at NameHero.com we upsell it in both our shared and reseller hosting packages. And let me show you an example. If I go over here to our main site and I click get started now, let's say I select our plus package. This is our most popular hosting package and I enter in a domain, we'll just use namehero.org. You can see dedicated IP address comes up and it says under it, take full control of your website for dedicated IP address ensures the highest level of email delivery. So that's the main reason why people want a dedicated IP address is for email delivery. I blogged last year and if you go to namehero.com slash startup you can um, search for these blogs and, and find them. Uh, but last year I blogged about how a dedicated IP address can improve your email deliverability with shared hosting. So in short it only takes one outdated WordPress theme plugin install on an IP address just to cause complete havoc with email delivery. So if you don't have a dedicated IP address and you're sharing an IP address with other customers it only takes one of those customers to forget to update WordPress or to you know, not care um, or to not update their themes and plugins um, often, become compromised, and then an attacker could send email through that IP address causing you problems for yours. Now at Name Hero, we're very proactive to this. We monitor all IPs every single day, 24 hours a day. We have a blacklist monitoring system set up. So if a malicious, um, if someone's doing malicious activity from one of our IPs, we are made aware very quickly and we shut it down, but it still doesn't um, avoid the fact that it can wreak havoc on other accounts. I mean, even if we shut it, it since there's real-time blacklisting, I put this in my post, Microsoft, AOL, um, all the big companies nowadays have what's called real-time blacklisting, meaning the second bad emails start to come from IP, then they start rejecting that IP and it's all in real time. It's, it doesn't take any amount of time for it to go on the blacklist. Um, so that's why it's important to have a dedicated IP because even though we're going to be made aware, we're going to shut it down quickly, um, an hour or two could make a big difference, especially if you're trying to get emails out to your um, customers or you're trying to get emails out to uh, people within your organization. Um, with a dedicated IP address, it, you're the only one using it. If you're a reseller, you have the ability to share that dedicated IP with your customers um, or you can just use it for your own um, usage. Now. Another reason why is reverse IP lookups. There's some tools out there that allow you to type in an IP address and it will show you the websites that are hosted on that IP. You can Google um, IP reverse IP lookup or you get the signal.com has one. And there's many out there. Um, but many people, they do this for a number of reasons. One, if you're a professional organization, you, want, you don't want people to know you're on shared hosting. You want them to think you have all your servers set up and all that stuff. So some people will buy a dedicated IP just to prevent these reverse lookups. So when they do one, it's just their site on the IP. I know DomainTools.com will show um, your site is hosted on a dedicated server as long as you have a dedicated IP address. So in short, it just makes it look more professional. Um, when I personally used to run a lot of affiliate marketing campaigns, I didn't want reverse lookups on my IPs because I didn't want it to reveal all the other domains that I was using. So I would get a dedicated IP address for each one of my domains. That way if they looked it up, they would only find the one that they already saw. Um, so it's up to you. You can use it in either way. The reverse lookups is a, is a big reason, especially when it comes to privacy and all that. Um, some resellers, they like to have all their customers on the same IP so they can keep track of who's on what network, and I can understand that from a networking standpoint. Finally, the final reason is SSL certificates. Um, back in the old days, I say, um, you used to have to have a dedicated IP address in order to get an SSL certificate. Um, this is because most web hosts back in the day did not have server name indication enabled, which allows um, multiple certificates on the same IP. At Name Hero, we have this enabled because we also have our auto SSL module, which allows free and automatic SSL certificates for all domains, all subdomains across the Name Hero network. So it wouldn't work for us to require a dedicated IP address because then we couldn't offer our free certificates. Um, so we do have that enabled and you, you do not, I repeat, you do not have to have a dedicated IP to have an SSL certificate at Name Hero. I know we get that a lot in the pre-sales department. 
Now, if you do want to purchase an extended validation certificate or a wildcard certificate, you might benefit um, in a couple ways from having a dedicated IP address, but it's not a requirement. So if you want one of those certificates, you know, that has your company name up here or maybe a wildcard certificate so you can use it on multiple domains, um, then you could order an IP, a dedicated IP if you would like because there might be some uh, benefits to that as well. Okay, so how do you get your free dedicated IP? We all want free. Our corporate reseller package, most popular package in our reselling department, and our basic business hosting package. Um, they each have a complimentary dedicated IP address. So if you don't want to pay the $29.95 a year, which is $250 a month, then get one of these packages. Um, if you don't, then you can just buy the IP and you can buy additional ones for $29.95 a year. We don't place limits on how many you can buy as a customer, but you have to give us a reason that is approved by our anti-spam department. Um, so you can't, um, you can't just buy IPs to buy IPs. You have to have a reason. Uh, and that's so we make sure that you're not using the IPs to spam. Uh, but personally, I don't see why you would not get a dedicated IP address. If it's an option, why would you not? Because it's only going to be an advantage. It's not going to be a disadvantage. It's only going to help your account. It's only going to help your emails. So um, I definitely recommend it. I think everyone should have it. And um, you know, if you choose not to, we well, have a lot that choose not to off the, right off the bat, but then they come back a month or a couple weeks later and say, hey, can you please add this? The only problem with adding it later is the DNS has to propagate all over again. So if we switch you to a dedicated IP, you might have to, you have a 24 hour period where your site might appear to be offline because we're swapping out something in the network. So that's why I just recommend from the very beginning to, to do the dedicated IP address. If you have any questions, feel free to let us know, reach out to our team. We're more than willing to help you out and explain this or even add one to your account. Um, besides that, thank you for using namehero.com. We certainly appreciate your business. Have a great day. Everybody.